Hey everyone and welcome back to Robot Boy and today is a very special day indeed. At 11am BST, Sean Murray, the man himself, tweeted out a capital letters small announcement. Ahead of this announcement however, he let us know that these details are going to leak anyway. Uh, so I'm glad that he actually ran with it and just let us know up front and that's a key thing that I'm going to be talking about in this video is about being up front. So this is the first major bit of communication from Sean and Hello Games regarding No Man's Sky directly since last summer and well although this piece of information was huge we still kind of as always don't really know about what it all means as a whole but it's it's a good start. So No Man's Sky next. This is it. This is going to be the talking point for the next few months. What is No Man's Sky next? What is the significance of the word next? I mean, obviously we can kind of assume what it's referring to generally as a whole, like the next step for No Man's Sky. Could it have deeper meaning? Well, I don't know, not yet. And I'm sure you're going to see a load of speculation videos floating around. I mean, I'm definitely going to make one when I can gather a better understanding of it and have more time to think about it. But yeah, for now, Generally about the update in particular and specifically, not too much is known. However, there is a huge bit of information that was included in the announcement and that is No Man's Sky is coming to Xbox. So if you play Xbox and for some reason you follow No Man's Sky, congratulations, you're gonna get it. If you haven't played it before, if you are an Xbox player and you're just watching this video, welcome, it's a great community. Um, welcome to the channel and I do hope that you enjoy playing the game when it does finally launch on your system. The announcement itself mentioned Xbox, which yeah, it blew everyone's minds. What? What could this all mean? Well, immediately afterwards, Sean Murray then released a post directly on the Microsoft website. Uh, I'm not going to read all of it in particular, but he starts off by saying, I'm super excited to announce No Man's Sky and its latest major feature content update next are coming soon. To Xbox One and will be enhanced for Xbox One X with support for HDR, 4K and more. So okay well first of all HDR and 4K they already exist on PC and PS4 Pro you can already get that so that's nothing new but obviously coming to Xbox One X that's going to be crazy and I can't wait to see what that looks like on the X actually. He then proceeds to summarize the game and obviously we all know what the game entails we know what it's about um, but what I'm taking away from this is it's a legit promo message to Xbox players like it, it, it's probably advertising the game people who may not have heard of the game before or might not know completely what you can do in it now and to me this suggests that we might be seeing a whole new legit promo campaign begin to surface and uh, I'm not talking about it being Wake and Titan related or anything like that but I'm talking about a genuinely real online marketing campaign uh, as obviously Waking Titan is not the way to advertise the general public about your product. It might, they might genuinely be partnering with Xbox to start promoting the game properly. And it already seems like they're doing that by having this post on their website. Now this is the real kicker, if we kind of skip to the end. So Sean ends the post by saying this. So he says, which brings us to next, our next step on a longer journey for us and the No Man's Sky community. This is our biggest update so far and something we've been working ridiculously hard on. And after its release, we'll continue to support No Man's Sky with significant and free content updates on Xbox One. And I assume he means PlayStation and PC as well. But obviously this is on Microsoft, so he's not going to say that. Anyway, Next has a lot that we're going to surprise people with and I can't wait until we can share more. Neither can we, Sean. Neither can we. That's the biggie right there. So there's quite a lot to unpack here. Uh, firstly, Longer journey for us and the community. Well, that pretty much confirms it, everyone. No Man's Sky is here to stay. Don't expect a new game from them just yet, or for them to abandon the game completely after this new update. Hello Games are going to be working on No Man's Sky, are going to be making it massive for much longer than we anticipated. Biggest update so far. So we kind of assumed that it was going to be the biggest update so far, given the time taken since Atlas Rises. Uh, and then now them saying that the release window is going to be summer. I mean, we, we were all thinking sort of today was going to be the update in the last 24 hours. That was a big thing. We thought maybe the 1st of May 
um, sort of kind of the latest, but now summer, probably looking, yeah, like June, on, between June, July and August. Uh, and it, it basically will make it a year's worth of content by that point, which is going to be insane. Uh, Sean then further hits home the point about continuous content, saying it will be significant and most importantly, free, which, you know what? It's, that's phenomenal from all angles. Seriously, major ratings to them. In an age where microtransactions and paid DLC is the embedded norm, to then see free content being released for this long down the line by a small studio is just amazing. So you know what? Hats off to you guys. And lastly, he finishes with, next has a lot we're going to surprise people with. Now, I don't know, Sean, have you, have you been on Twitter or Reddit or YouTube in the last seven months? Because... We as a community, we pretty much covered every single possibility as to what we think you could do with the game. But then if you still think that this new update is going to manage to genuinely surprise us even more, then my word, should we be excited. Also, with this huge support coming from Xbox as well, we're in for a treat. I, I can honestly tell you it's going to be in, we're going to be in for a treat. Overall then, this is just a brilliant time to be in this community. Yes, okay, today we didn't get the 1.5 update. Mm, okay. Well, yes, we didn't even get a release date specifically. We got a release window, but we didn't even get the date. We didn't get any more Waking Titan news. However, we got something even better in my opinion. We got an honest and we got a genuine update on the game as a whole from Hello Games' side. And they proved that they do have plans for us and they are working insanely hard to provide us with the most badass update ever. And then go one up and say, yeah, you know what, after we do that, we're going to keep on updating it because we're coming to Xbox 2 and we're not going to stop there. We got tweets from Sean and not in an out there elusive message type of way like he usually does. They were direct tweets about the game. A full blog post from Sean. Xbox is going to get the game. We got a video. We got a new title in No Man's Sky Next. The communication level seems to be rising fast. And I do hope this is a big first step in Hello Games' journey towards becoming more outgoing with their information. So, what comes next? Well, we're going to have to wait and see, as always. But generally, I think that we can all just chill out a bit now, you know. The hardcore, senseless hyping, the stir-crazy theories. The, with Waking Titan, you, you're always on edge thinking, is it going to release tomorrow? What's going to release today? Something happened in the last hour, the last five minutes. Who knows? But summer 2018... We have this window now, so we can definitely 100% chill out a bit, you know? Take a step back, play some other games, look at the news, sit back a bit, because we all know something big is coming in summer, and when it does come, we will all be ready. And that's it, everyone. Please do leave your ideas and your thoughts in the comments below. What do you think the significance of the word next means directly in relation to the future of No Man's Sky? And this is an obvious question, but of course, are you excited for the new update? What do you think about this announcement? I want to hear all your thoughts down below. And as always, please give the video a like if you enjoyed it. And do subscribe to join me on this journey if you haven't done so already. And with that, I'll see you all in the next video.